Things to Come, 1936, directed by William Cameron Menzies, starring Raymond Massey, Edward Chapman, and Ralph Richardson. A hypothetical chronicle of a hundred years for a small town in England, where scientists strive towards building a utopia after a decades-long war tears the world apart. Crazy fact, this film was written by H.G. Wells. The second I found that out, I was instantly interested in checking this one out. This is an insanely ambitious film, whose innovative production matches the forward-thinking narrative of the film explorers. Almost every cinematic trick in the book is used to bring the visuals to life. From miniatures, to rear projection, along with creative camera work, and clever editing. The world building in this film is wonderful too. The post-war village of repurposed wreckage is terrific, and the scientific utopia they build underground later on looks wonderful. Interestingly, no one is inherently good or evil in the script. They do bad things, but the antagonists are simply people set in the old ways of the world or uncomfortable with the rate of progress. A recurring theme in this film is optimism, and how devotion to science could lead to prosperity which coming from an early science fiction writer is totally expected and refreshingly upbeat. This is the story of a dreamer who dreamed of an idyllic future, a callback to a simpler time before pessimism and distrust became popular attributes in fiction. Also available in color, if black and white isn't your thing. Verdict recommended. An absolute feast for the eyes that looks to the stars. That concludes this week's review. If there's any obscure sci-fi horror film you'd like to suggest, feel free to leave a comment below. Make sure to tune in next week for another thrilling low-budget adventure.